welcome to this virtual tour, in which we will discover Ireland's breathtaking natural beauty at the Cliffs of Maha. These cliffs rise majestically from the Atlantic Ocean, with heights soaring up to over 700 feet. Stretching for five miles along the coast, they offer an unparalleled experience of nature's power and grandeur. After discovering the cliffs, we will also bring a visit to the nearby city of Galway, known for its lively cultural scene and rich history. But first, let's enjoy our time here at the Cliffs of Maha. The ocean carved these cliffs out from sedimentary rocks, dating back over 320 million years. The towering formations tell the ancient story of earth, sea and time, and have intertwined to create this unique landscape. The cliffs are a highlight of the famous Wild Atlantic Way coastal route. This area showcases the untamed beauty of the Atlantic coastline and there's an almost mythical quality to it. The cliffs have long inspired tales of magical realms and ancient maritime legends. This aura of enchantment rooted in Ireland's rich tapestry of folklore draws over one million visitors annually, making it one of the most visited destinations in the country. Wandering along the cliffs, you'll encounter O'Brien's Tower, a 19th century viewing point erected by Sir Cornelius O'Brien. This historical tower offers spectacular views of the Aran Islands, Galway Bay, and the Twelve Pins mountain range, providing a glimpse into the area's rich history and geography. Interestingly, Sir Cornelius O'Brien built the tower not only as a viewing point, but also as part of his larger efforts to bring tourism to the Cliffs of Maha, which makes him an early pioneer of Irish tourism. Recognised as a special protection area, the Cliffs of Maha are not only a popular tourist destination, but also a critical site for ecological conservation. Efforts to preserve the natural habitat and protect the diverse seabird populations, including the charming puffins, are essential to maintaining the balance between welcoming visitors and safeguarding this natural treasure for future generations.